Greetings and salutations. This is Derek with Taylor Whips. I just got a new whip from Rich Cottrell of Malaroy Whip Company, and I'm so excited to open it and show you what it is. And here we are. This is a 10 foot Indiana Jones 4 whip that uh, Rich has been making. Uh, he has spent time uh, talking about the design with Anthony DeLongis, uh, talking about what he wanted, what he wishes that it would have been, and has been not just making things that are exactly like the movie, but has been making it like the movie should have had it. And I really like that. Um, not just sticking to what the screen shows, but uh, making the best whip possible. So I am very, very impressed with uh, the braiding, how fine the, the strands are cut, uh, the coil, the weight of this is honestly very manageable. Uh, I guess we'll see when we <laughs> get out to use it. This is beautiful. I love having the um, uh, that little calling card attached to the wrist loop. Uh, couldn't be happier. Uh, I'm excited to take this out and crack it and try it and see how it feels. Here's the Indy 4 that I just got. Uh, hopefully the sprinklers don't get me too badly. Uh, let's give it a test. Flows beautifully. I have excellent control. It rolls. It's a little stiff still, but the loop is very consistent. It works very well for the rolling loop style. If I can keep from getting tangled. Beautiful. So I have here a 10 foot, it's a little bit longer than 10 foot, Terry Jacka as a comparison. And the, the handle binding is very similar uh, on this, but the, uh, the rich Cottrell whip uh, goes a whole lot finer than the Terry Jacka whip. And as such, I don't feel the the overwhelming weight of 10 feet as much. Uh, to give you a comparison, the Terry Jacka whip, I, it takes a lot to energize it and keep it energized and does really well with straightforward throws and all of the things that go in single directions. By contrast, even though this whip from Rich Cottrell is shorter, it is so much more refined and feels much more like a seven or an eight foot whip. Simply with the amount of control I get, I can go for any of the angles and I don't have to work to make the whip respond like I do with the Terry Jack whip. This is so light and elegant that I could use this for a long period of time without tiring myself out and would still have incredible precision with every move.
I don't think I could have asked for better. Thank you so much, Rich.